Hey guys, I'm back with my paperback swap uh, haul here and a, some more books too uh, that that I didn't get from paperback swap. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, here's the, um, this is what I received in the mail. Uh, this is how it came in the mail. Uh, cause you, in the mail, you can print, uh, this paper right here off a of paperback swap. If you have a small book and you can wrap it up and see it already said media mail and it, boy, up under here, it'll tell you how much it costs to mail the book. Uh, so I, this is how the book came for me. So let's, let me open this up if I can. Cause it been, it's wrapped up really good here. So let's see, can I open it here with these scissors? Hopefully I don't mess the book up while I'm trying to get up in here. So can I open this? Okay. So I ordered three books and I put two on my wish list uh, but um, I only got two books because one of the books I guess the person didn't have so it ended up going on my wish list so now I have um, three books on my wish list here oh my she wrapped this really good uh, let's see here get this open and like I said I, I got some other books too I, I went to um, I was on Instagram and I had a I followed this place called Book Addict and they're getting their bookstores get ready to close so they're having a 60% sale so um I went over there today. Um, I tried to call, but I couldn't find a telephone number, so I didn't get to call them to see where they're open for Labor Day. Uh, and I tried to find where I saw it on Instagram, but I couldn't find it again to find their telephone number. But I went over there anyway, because they have an Ollie's over there. And so I went over there, and I said, well, if they're closed, I just go into Ollie's. So I went into Ollie's and found two books, yeah. <laughs> but here's the book that I ordered off a of paperback swap. It's Hudson's Crossing by Antonia Washington. And it's a Kam Kamani romance. So that's one of the books that I got. Uh, let's open this other one up. This also is, this next book is also by uh, Antonia Washington. So let's see, can I get this one open? So yeah, I went into Ollie's and found two books. I'll show those to you also. Uh, if I can get this open without messing my book up. Oh my goodness. Uh, a lot going on trying to open this book up. Is everybody eating good today? Um... Uh, why every time we have a holiday, we feel like we need to eat something? <laughs> a barbecue or something. <laughs> I didn't do anything today. Nothing. Just resting. That's it. And here's the other book. Uh, this is uh, The Doctor's Private Visit. Both of these are by Atonia Washington. I like her. She has some nice book covers. I really love her book covers. And I'll read you a little bit of this. By Coastal Living may be unconventional, but Riley and Asher make it work. Riley, fierce New York career and Asher lucrative Phoenix sport agency are the perfect balance to their sexy my, I want to see if it's, I heard some beep over here. I want to see was my camera still recording. It is. Where was I at here? Asher Lucrative Phoenix Sports Agency are the perfect balance to their sexy, satisfying marriage, which is what make Asher's sudden ultimatum to Riley, leave New York or leave him so shocking. And Riley has an even bigger surprise in, in store, forcing her to decide where her heart and future really lie. So that sounded interesting. And they're already, you don't really get too many books where the couple is already married or whatever. So I thought that was interesting. And this is Hudson Crossing. And the, I guess the, if you see this right here, it is already know, let you know what the little surprise is going to be. Yeah. <laughs> and this is the Dr. Private Visit. Read some of this. When Capri Timmons traced her chaotic Miami life for suburbia, the reserve photographer doesn't realize her fantastic new house comes with a gorgeous doctor next door. Sexy, way too easy on the eye, Tiberius Evan is just the kind of man Capri has vowed to steer clear of at all costs. 
except the more she resists, the more Tiberius wants her. That sounded interesting too, and he's a doctor, so there you go for those two. Uh, next up, I have, let's see what this is. Cut this one open. It, um, they didn't wrap this one up. It just came in a regular envelope here from Paperback Swap. And she put it, wrapped, put it in this. this is. This is a romantic suspense I ordered by Cindy Gerard. Show no mercy. Read some of this. Only two things can compel journalist Jenna McMillan back to Bonus Iris after terrorists held her captive there just months before a rare interview with a shadowy billionaire in the memory of the dark and dangerous man who saved her. Bad guys, bums, and bullets are Gabriel Jones' way of life, but he'll never forget the brash redhead he rescued not so long ago or the passionate kiss they shared before he sent her packing. So I was like, let me give this a try. I like this cover too. Show no mercy. I got that from Paperback Swap. Let's see what else I got over here. Let's see the next one here. Put this one open. Oh, this one, this one not from Paperback Swap. Paperback Swap. This is from uh, Amazon here. I got this one from Amazon. Let's see. And you know I love Carrick and Bry. Uh, Brian, I never pronounced her name right. And this is How to Love a Duke in 10 Days. Oh, this this is really thick right here. How many pages in here? I hope this is uh, good. Uh, this is 440 pages. How to Love a Duke in 10 Days. So I was like, let me. I've bought most of all her books so far. Um, but the only one I really, really love was the first one. I can't think of what the name of it. Maybe she have it in here. The Highwayman. That was the first book. So I got all that. I got the Hunter, the Highlander, the Duke, the Scott Bess, his wife, and the Duke with the Dragon Tattoo. I have the Duke with the Dragon Tattoo. I haven't read it yet. It's around here somewhere. But um, I hope this one's good. Like I said, I really, really love the Highwayman. I love I love the Hunter. The Hunter was good. But the Highwayman, out of all these, the Highwayman is my favorite. The rest of these were, eh, they were okay. So I hope this one is really, really good. And I'll read a little bit of this. Famed and brilliant, Lady Alexandria Lane has always known how to look out for herself, but nobody would ever expect that she has darkness in her past, one that she pays a blackmailer to keep buried. Now with her family near bankruptcy, Alexandra strikes upon a solution. Get married to one of the empire's most wealthy, eligible bachelors, even if he does have the reputation of a devil. So that's sounding interesting. And this book looked really, really thick. It looked like it's thicker than any of the other books she, uh, she's written, but I don't know, but... It seemed like it to me. Kerrigan Bry, How to Love a Duke in 10 Days. Let's see what else I have over here. Now, this one is from Paperback Swap, I think. Okay, it's on here. Yep. This one is Paperback Swap. I got a, a historical here, Harlequin Historical by Michelle Willingham to send with a Viking. And I saw this on, dog, what is her name? Hold that thought. I'll be right back. Hey, guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. I had to go and answer the phone. But anyway, I was uh, telling you all about, um, I saw this book right here on, let me see what her name is. I saw this on YouTube on, see what her name is. She was going over some books that she had got. Uh, what is her name? Shannon Rittler. Uh, on her channel. She does a lot of different stuff on her channel. She, does, she doesn't She does just do romance books. Uh, I think she might have had about two romance books. And I saw those two. And they look interesting. And I was like, let me check it out. Uh, so I just, I got this one right here. Um, and if I can find the video that she was talking about, the books in, I will put that link below if I can find it because I don't remember which one it was. Like I said, she do a lot of different stuff. She talk about movies. She just talk about a lot of different stuff on her channel. And uh, when I was looking at it, she just happened to mention some romance books. So that's why I 
uh, went and got, uh, I went and I went on paperback swap and looked it up and I found it. And this is uh, Michelle Winningham, Forbidding Viking to Sin with a Viking. It's a Holoquin historical. I read a little bit of this. Karig O'Brien defended herself bravely when the enemy landed. Only now she finds herself alone with one very angry Viking. Styra Hart Raider. Yeah, I don't know if I'm pronouncing these names right. Yeah, <laughs> these Viking names, be yeah, they're hard to pronounce. Sailed to Ireland intending to trade, never expecting to find himself held captive in chains by a beautiful Irish maiden. So that sounded interesting to me when she was uh, describing the books. And I was like, let me get, let me go on paperback swap and see what they have it. And they did. So I went ahead and got it. And this is book one in the Forbidden Viking series, I guess. And this, and, and to tempt a Viking is going to be book two. Yeah, but don't take my word on that. But I think that is, that's how it is. But like I said, I saw this on Shannon Riddler channel. And I'll try to find that video. I don't know if I can because she got a, quite a few videos on there. But I'll try to find the one that she had this in there. Um, and I'll post it below. Holoquin Historical. And then I... Also, Paperback Swap also have a, uh, they do DVDs. So I went and ordered a DVD off of there. Um, I swapped DVD. I, I listed some DVDs on there. So I got this one for free. Uh, and this Man of Steel. Got this from uh, Swapper DVD. Uh, when I first looked at Man of Steel, it wasn't, oh, it wasn't all that to me. It done grew on me over time um, that I really, really like Henry Cavell. Uh, he's the epitome of Superman to me. He has the, the chiseled features and everything that I would think Superman would look like. So I was like, let me get this. And then, you know, it got the little love story with him and old girl. I forgot. What is her name? Uh, what is her? Amy Adams. I like Amy Adams. She's a favorite actress of mine. So I, I like both of them in this movie. So I was like, let me get this. And this Man of Steel. I got that from Swapper DVD. And then, like I mentioned, I also went to Ollie's and I got these two books from Ollie's. Uh, this is Adriana Anders, uh, In His Hands. And I got this because this is dealing like with a, um, I think she was in a cult or something, but I read the little synopsis. Amy Merkley has been a member of the Church of the Apocalyptic Faith since she was a child. And there's no way out until her darkly handsome brooding neighbor defies the rules, and takes her into the safety of his arms. So I said, this sounds like it's going to be interesting. And it's a good and thick book. I think I mentioned I like my books. I like when they are thick. And this has, let's see how many pages this has in here. Uh, 409 pages. So I hope this is good. And I only paid $1.29 for this. And I got it from Ollie's. Next, I saw this one in Ollie's. Anna Smith. Pronouncing that last name right. And this is The Outlaw. And I'm, I guess this is in a series, The Last Chance Cowboy series. I don't know what book it is in the series, though. I'll read a little bit of this. Amanda Porterfield longs to experience real adventure. So when she's off of a teaching position, so when I read that she was going to be a teacher, uh, that sold it for me. She's offered a teaching position in bustling Tucson. She leaps at the chance despite unknown dangers, dangers like the mysterious Self Rover. So when I found out she was going to be a teacher, uh, I think I mentioned I like those kind of occupation for the heroine. I was like, let me check this out. So this is The Outlaw by Anna Smith. So that's all I have, I think. Uh, I think I opened all my packages here. Yeah, that's it for my little haul, my little paperback uh, swap haul, and my Ollie haul. And so that's all I have. I have, I got three books from Paperback Swap. These three. Go over them again. I got those three from Paperback Swap. I got this one also from Paperback Swap, the historical. And I got this one from Amazon. These two from Ollie's and this one from Swapper DVD, a, a subsidiary, a subsidiary of Paperback Swap. They're, they're the same people. They have uh, one where they do books and one where they do DVDs. So I all got that from the Swapper DVD. So that's all I have for now. Uh, hope you enjoyed my little haul here and my little... Um, 
what is it tbr for this month hope you enjoy that too but until next time i hope everyone continue to enjoy their day off today happy labor day and i will be coming back again uh, maybe sometime this week with another video hopefully but until then keep reading those romances and i'll see you all later bye